Uh, I'd like to get your educated guess uh, how far into the future before religions disappear, if ever. That human beings disappear? Religions. Oh, religions. Disappear. Yeah. Oh. Um, yeah, I think it's one or the other, actually. Um, I don't know. Well, it's, if you take, I mean, I'm not particularly optimistic that it's going to happen in any short time frame, but if, if, you, if you take this, my suite of concerns, and map them on to uh, the kinds of predictions you get from someone like Ray Kurzweil, just, I mean, just how, I don't know if you know Ray Kurzweil's work on the singularity and, and just this, the kind of the doubling time of, of uh, uh, technological innovation. Uh, getting shorter and shorter, the implications of, of this on his, if, he, if anything like his projections are true, uh, it's something like we're going to have 20,000 years of cultural progress in this century, you know, as measured in, at the rate of progress in the year 2000. Um, that could be crazy, but if, so, if something analogous to that is true, then, then our ability to foresee just how quickly things can change is, is I mean, there is a there's a curtain uh, uh, blocking the future uh, there, and uh, or an, an event horizon of some kind. And so I, I really, you know, I, I can barely imagine what it was like before we had cell phones and the internet. And that's, you know, it's been like 5,000 days or whatever. Um, uh, so it's, uh, it seems to me things could change very, very quickly. Uh, but still embedded as I am in the present and seeing how intractable these belief systems seem to be in the present. I'm, I can't say I'm hopeful that it's going to happen in any of our lifetime. Jonathan. 